What's going on YouTube? Today I want to share a product with you I bought eh, about four months ago from the vendor you see here on this card, Mount Baker Vapor. Uh, this is out in uh, Washington State. Uh, the product I purchased was the Anakin SVD Starter Kit. Uh, now with this kit, I didn't get the uh, the battery, but I did get a tank. Uh, not this particular one, but I got the iClear. I think it was the iClear 30 that come with it, and it's a telescoping mod. Uh, when I first got mine, it was a fairly new product. It was about four months ago or so, and. Uh, the entire kit, I think, was right around a hundred bucks then. Um, they have them now for sixty nine ninety nine at Mount Baker Vapor. Uh, it's made of uh, stainless steel. The threading is uh, five ten. The voltage is uh, three point three to six volts. Wattage can be adjusted from three volt or three watts to uh, fifteen watts. And that's in half watt increments. The voltage, once again, was 3.3 to 6 volts, and that goes in uh, 0.1 volt increments. Uh, it has short circuit protection, reverse battery protection circuit, uh, battery voltage detection, on off battery switch, LED power, battery power display, uh, low voltage warning, overtime vaping warning, and that's when you hold the button in. Uh, telescopic tube supports an 18350, 18500, or 18650 battery. Um, has battery safety protection uh, and a built in three digit display. So you get all that for $69.99. Now I don't see the, uh, the kit on here. So basically you would get those pieces right there for uh, $70. So you have to buy these extra. So let me put this together here real quick and show you how it works. So right here is the, uh, the actual, this has the chip and all that stuff in it, the 510 threaded connection up there, uh, also Ego. Because you can put you can put all kinds of stuff on this. In fact, let me get one of these out. And I'll just show you here. I'll set that off to the side. So what we want to do get this stuff out of my way here. What we want to do with this is you got your telescoping part here, and it just screws on. Okay. And take your battery, your positive end is this end right here. And with the plus sign, the type of battery I'm using. There you go, right there. Okay. Positive end goes to the top, towards this area, towards the connector. The big end towards the bottom. So you put that in, and you get this adjusted just how you want it. Here's your bottom cap with the vent holes for the battery. Let me just screw this out a little bit. Pop that on, you see the button. I don't know if you saw that or not. But the button starts to uh, light up. Well, with the battery in it. See that? And there goes your display. Then you just go ahead and tighten this down. There we go. That way there's no battery rattle. Alright. 
Now we take, this is actually called a beauty ring or a thread cover. So you just take this and you screw it on like that right there. Then you can take a tank like an iClear 16. It already has a little bit of e-juice in it. You screw that on just like that right there. Move this camera up here. Okay, so you end up with something like this. Okay. So now to power this on, you press it five times. I don't know if I got it or not, but let's see. There you go. And then this thing is automatically locked. So you hold in your function buttons are right here. Here's everything that you use that you use with this device. You can see all of that in there. See that? And then there's your screen. So you actually will hold these in, these two buttons, and we'll turn it around. You hold the top button and the bottom button in. And then there goes your your battery resistance or your atomizer resistance than the uh, the watts that you're vaping at so you hold it in about that long and let go and now you can change your power and all that stuff so there you go it's from 3 all the way up to 15 I'm going to give this a vape real quick So as you can see, it vapes pretty well. I'm not going to go th through all of the functions of this device. I just wanted to do a quick review on it real quick here. But you have voltage, as you can see now. Actually, I'm still in watts. But anyway, I just wanted you to see how this thing works. And you pop these, uh, like this is a little iClear 16. This is obviously an Ego style. And then you have the full size. This is a Anakin X1. You take, pop this on top of this device here. And that looks like that. Doesn't really match, but it does thread up very well. Uh, I've got the Kanger Air Tank Mega. It fits on there nicely. Right there is the uh, Aspire Nautilus. It fits on there flush. It looks nice. Um, back here, I've got the uh, Canamod DNA 30 with a K-Fun Light Plus version 2. Let's pop that on there. I think I got some grape e-juice in this or something. So there's what that looks like. That really looks good right there. I'm going to give that a vape real quick at 15 watts. I have my own coil in this, by the way. It's a really awesome vapor production. So, as I said before, this is a telescoping mod, so... What happens is, we pull this tank off of here. If you use a shorter battery, okay, we'll take this one out. If you use something like this little tiny guy right here, which is a little... 18,350 or something like this right, this right here so 18,500 you just pop it in like that you see that there and you just go ahead and screw it towards the top 
so I can take a second to uh, kind of get it up there. Then you pop the bottom on like that. Twist this down some. And then there you go. Now it's shortened up to 18,500. Okay. And same goes for the little 18,350. And this makes it into an extremely small and very manageable device. So get this bottom started here. And look at that. So power it on. There it is. Then we pop our tank back on. This is the K-Fun light. 3.1 or I mean k Light Lite Plus version 2 my fault and then look how little that is that's very manageable there it is laying in my hand so very cool let's give this a vape you can see when you fire the button there it lights up green and as the battery wears down that'll turn to like a, a yellow color and then a red and let you know that it needs to be charged up the display works very well see it's that it's locked right there so that keeps me from turning the voltage or wattage up and down by accident so to get out of that you just like I did earlier just hold these two buttons in And then a little bit longer there you go once it shuts off then you can go in and start changing all that stuff around so there you have it the Anakin I taste SVD uh, so built the device is built very well uh, I've been using it now it was actually the very first mod that I got after I purchased one of these two years ago which is a like a little Sega like and I kept smoking because of that little sig like But once I got the SVD from Enikin, that was it. I quit smoking. I haven't smoked a cigarette since. So I highly recommend this device. And it's a great value. It's made very well. It's built sturdy. Uh, the 510 connection is really solid and every every different type of device I put on here works perfectly let's try for example right here is a, a Zenith with my own little drip tip on it we'll pop this on here I've actually never put this on this device before and there you go it fits perfectly and looks pretty cool too I might add so, we'll give this a bait too. Awesome. Okay. Got a little bit of juice on me. Like I say, everything I put on this fits. I think it fits perfectly. Right here's a Trident. RDA. We'll even do the, uh, here's the Trident. I'll do that first. Sorry about that. I dropped my atomic. So there's the trident. If you can read that there. I don't know if you can see it. The autofocus on this thing is just horrific. I'll do it manually. There we go. That's a trident clone, by the way. But anyway, you get the idea. So that looks very cool. Fits perfectly on there. As you can see, it's flush. Alright. Now the one that's not going to be flush, but will still fit, is going to be the Atomic. I mean, this is a little tiny tank anyway. This thing is awesome. I love it. So let's pop this on there. And... 
there's what it looks like so you got a little bit of overhang on it but it still fits down on there flush I mean still looks very cool and check that out and give this a little vape too so there you have it that's it guys that's really all I wanted to show you uh, it's the Anakin I taste SVD pick one up at Mount Baker Vapor uh, that's mountbakervapor.com. You can pick this up for $69.99. It's the Anakin Eye Taste SVD Express Kit. So, thanks for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe, share my videos with everybody, and thanks for stopping by. Take care.